just a warning. If I play like shit, I'm sorry, but last game caused me fucking brain damage. So yeah. Zone A. You captured Zone C. Zone A. You captured Zone C. No 
Zone A. What are they for So good news, the Conqueror loves light spamming left. Keep that in mind. You lost zone C. Not done yet. Zone C. I just fucking hit by a bear trap. I swear to God, bro.
Why do I get the city ass team fucking enemies from the last game? Like, why? I don't deserve this loss. Zone C. Yep, you guys are just as bad as I remember. You capture Zone A. You lost Zone C. You. <laughs> You captured Zone C. Zone C. 
You lost zone A. You lost zone C. Zone C. You lost Zone C. You capture Zone C. You lost Zone A. You captured Zone C. Enemy team is breaking. You lost zone A. Zone C. You lost Zone C. 
You captured Zone A. Captured Zone C. Zone A. You captured Zone C. You captured Zone A.
The fucking light spam, Jesus fuck. Bro, there's a guy right there. Stop ignoring me. Or stop ignoring him and fight me, bro. Teammate, you are about to fucking kill me there. Oh, great. That wasn't for here, luckily. You captured zone A. This is the area of the map I'm comfortable with, so I'm sticking here. Why does this game just let people that light spam just become OP, bro? Like, why is light spamming the easiest way to get fucking levels and shit? Like, come on, bro. Like, legit, if this- if light spamming was not so fucking OP in this game, my guy would be absolutely fucking dog shit, more than he already is. But because light spamming in this game and spamming in general is so fucking OP, they can just do it and win. Teammates, can you guys stop 1v2-ing? Like, come on, bro. I want a fucking fair 1v1, dude. And that's what happens when you don't do a fair 1v1, dude. I'm in pain after that one. I am in disarray after that fucking shit show. No, no one ports. Like I'm just chilling on my cat, and I gotta deal with fucking like spending a little century on you. Go, my team.
team again. Team fuck. But yeah, after this game I'm hopping off, I can't be bothered. I keep getting in the habit of not blocking and need to get back in the habit. Like I get in the habit and then I get out of it. And like why should Ancient Tree Hunter able to fuck me over? Cause yeah, I'm just used to fucking dodging. Like if they fucking do a random heavy or whatever, instead of blocking it, I fucking do my side fucking square thing to punish him for it. That's why I want to say I may be spamming it, but I'm not spamming it. I'm actually using it. It's just their fault for doing random, easily dodgeable heavies. It's their fault for doing that dumb shit, not mine for parrying it. I guess I don't even parrying it. More, it's punishing it. More like, but, you know. If you do a random upwards heavy, I'm going to dodge out of the way and fucking hit you back on the back side of the head. With a giant brass fucking shield. And then I'm gonna fucking stab your gut with a giant fucking pitchfork. AKA Trident. Oh, he has a mic. Game jet. Alright. Oh, yeah, yeah. How are oh. you today? Hello. Hey, Asset, can you join the PS4 party by chance? Huh? Could you join the PS4 party I invited you to by chance? Yeah, sure. Wait, invite one more time? Oh, all right, there we go. But, dude, last game, I'm, I'm doing like a YouTube video, kind of, I guess. Possibly. I don't know if it's good enough content yet. But the basis is, right? Bruh, light spamming, double team, and then they ledge me right at the start. Like, they... Ignore you, go for me. And because they're 2v1ing you, I stop them. They go for me, then they ledge me within the first 10 seconds of the fight. Like, my brother. It's, 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 yeah. I've been dealing with these motherfuckers for a few games, and it's... It's fun. I try to respect the 1v1, but at times with these motherfuckers, I just can't. You captured zone A. Yeah. I don't normally hop on these, but I'll see if there's... Okay, yes. I may or may not have thought this Kiosen was you. There's another one coming up, though. I can use some backup. Yep, of course, the sentry on the sides to 1v2. Runs past me to you and then decides to stop af going after you and double team me. Love it. Yep. And give a fair fight right in front of you, why wouldn't you go for it? Like the fuck? I'm coming over right now. Is the scent the one that's alive or dead? What? I mean, yeah, I guess he, he wasn't the one that did the toxicity, so I'll let him move. I want to be one him. Nice. But yeah. The sentry was doing lights and he was doing his fucking unblockable thing, so it was very, very fun. As, as you can assume. So, and the Kyosin was in front, so if I try to hit the sentry on, I would hit the bitches all guard. It was not a fun time. And I would also assume that you're a new rep 1 with Kyosin, considering when I go to the game, it says that you're rep 0, yet you have one rep with Kyosin. And that normally happens when someone recently reps up with a character, so. Don't do them like that. Damn, bro. But it is that toxic ass scent, so I... Never mind, they just lost a fucking bolt at my ass, so no, be toxic. Brother, my man tried his best to crossbow me and got fucking headshotted, bro. 
Dumbass. <laughs> that peacekeeper really wants that kill, bruh. God damn. He's hungry for that shit, yeah. I'm more comfortable at A, so I'm gonna stand over here. I'm gonna stay over here. No. No, I didn't get him, sadly. I'm barely missing, but, yeah. But I'm not gonna take the chance of getting headshotted. So you can take care of him. I'm sorry, Valk, but I gotta do the toe stab chain, brother. Cause I gotta get this shit over and done with, I'm sorry. Oh, God! Yeah, I'm, I realized that. I, I realized I was running out of stamina because I just wanted to kill the Valk. And then fucking Kiosen came up behind me and just... Yeah. Yeah. The call out on the... There's three people behind you! Was a little late, my brother. <laughs> it was a bit late. <laughs> but can you handle A or do you need me to respawn up? Yep. Okay, there's one more on the fucking um, mountain thing, so watch out. I'm gonna come kill him very quick since they got C. Don't try to kill him. I want him. I want him. I want him. No, I want him. He's the guy that was a bitch to me. I want him. Back up. I know. <laughs> I literally bought it for 7k because it was fucking awesome. <laughs> I'm poor now. But it was worth. God Eater has some of the coolest fucking shit ever, like some of the coolest executions. Cause like someone's being toxic to you, it's like he literally has the perfect executions to be like, Bitch, no the fuck you ain't. I've been playing him, cause I've, I'm a, this is a smurf account cause my main account was banned for like, I've had it for five years or whatever, and it was banned because I said WTF. But I've been playing since beta, and I've always loved Gladiator. Because I love Greek and North mythology, and I love Poseidon and Greek mythology. So when I first saw, um, so when I first saw Glad, I, w I thought of Poseidon, obviously, because of the trident. So I instantly, and the thing about the game is, if you don't have a bond with a character right away, you're going to struggle. So having that small bond with a character that early on was very helpful. Dude, how are dude? How are these some of these hitting me, bro? I don't understand. Cause I'm more of a dodge person than a block person. So when one v ones, it gives people that just do nothing but attacks and they can block semi well. Um, I resort to having to block, and because I don't do it often, I'm bad at it, so I die a lot. <laughs> so, so if you ever see me lose, um, impossible fight to lose. That's why. Yeah, I'm going yeah. And that ain't double teaming because for one, the Nabushi came to do the same thing against me, and he was my teammate was already dead. Bro, are you fucking kidding me? Bro, no fuck, dude. Do you know what the fuck they just did to me? So he was executing. So I killed the key. I tried to kill the Kyoshin, right? Nabushi came double teamed. He ran away using Archer thing and then ran at me. Some of the most cowardly shit I have seen in a long ass while. And my long ass while, I mean last game. <laughs> Bruh, how can you be a rep to fucking Kyoshin and be that? Oh my fucking god, bruh. You're rep to with a fucking samurai. Dude, I don't understand. This looks like it might be an unwinnable fight for this game. But you are able to be respawned at least. That peacekeeper's dead, yeah. I don't have much faith in this. Unless he gets revenge. No, he's dead, yeah. Bruh. Dude, legit some of the worst players I've seen. And legit, dude, if they did, like, dude, if it was, like, a baneable offense in this game to do a 2v1, they would have fucking lost. Because legit, 
they ain't not good enough to be doing 1v1s. If they did 1v1s, they would have got fucking shit stomped. Which is what I find the fucking funniest part about it. It's like legit, if they fucking did 1v1s, they would have lost that. Yeah, 1v2s, 1v3s is their fucking motto. Well, dude, I literally have people that do 1v2s, and then when my teammate comes to back me up, two more show up, so there's a 4v2. Like, they have to have more than the people they're fighting. Like, it's, or else they won't fight you. And then I've had people that are one shot that run away, so I kill the other guy that was killing me, and then when they see that I'm engaged with somebody else, they leave, they come, sorry, they come back and kill me from behind with a random heavy. So, yeah. But I'm gonna video clip this before it runs over an hour and I lose footage, so I'm gonna hop off, because it's... I've made at least five, seven videos today. I had to delete a lot of them, though, because I had, like, 20 gigs of fucking... Well, I'm gig I had, like, 20 fucking gigabytes of shit, yeah, bruh. Today's been a toxic day, so I've had a lot of content. <laughs> <laughs> I'm becoming a For Honor channel, and I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> uh, debatable. <laughs>